guys and welcome back to my channel so today's video is going to be a paycheck budget with me and it's going to be for my fourth paycheck of the month so let's get started um let's see okay so let's so the leftover that i currently have so this is for my 27th paycheck let me see uh, oh crap. Okay. Yeah, for the 27th. So, September 27th. Okay. So, I currently have left in my checking account $21.09. And I'm going to budget 1000 which I don't think I'm going to get. I missed. I left early from work. A day just because I was feeling sick so yeah okay so then okay so then my total that I will be working with is 10 21 09 and then I have no bills to pay for this week with so out of that I have groceries, which is 280, and that's for two weeks. And then gas, I'm gonna do 60, and I bump that up just because my husband's starting to do Ubering again, and so we're using more gas money. So I'm gonna do 60. I'm gonna instead of doing 55, I'm gonna do 60. And then from a pet. I'm going to do $50 and then for my kids I'm going to do 30 and that is 280 plus 60 plus 50 plus 30 is 420 okay so 1021 09 minus 420 that leaves me with 60109 to work with. Okay. And now for my sinking funds, these are the same. The only thing that I'm going to do is I have some money left over for family fun. So I think I'm going to lower it. Instead of taking out $80, I'm going to do 60 So that's the only change. So for Christmas, that stays, stayed the same with 42 my husband's allowance, that's $20, and my allowance is $20. And then for my family fund, I'm gonna do 60. For birthdays, I'm gonna do 40. And I just wanna save, because it's my husband's. And my, oh, excuse me, I'm tired. Um, I'm gonna do uh, $40 for birthday just because it's my husband's and my son's birthday in December. And I wanna start saving. And then shutters, 50 bucks. I think I will, I'm gonna get a quote and I'm gonna see how much more I need. Okay, so then 42, so for, okay, so the total that I need for my sinking funds is, so let's add these up, 42 plus 20 plus 20 plus 60 plus 40 plus 50. That is a total of, 232 I need I need for my sinking funds. So then 60109 minus 232 that leaves me with 36909 left over. And so then I go straight to my savings because I always put $100 into savings. 100 and that leaves me okay wait hold on 100 and then that leaves me with 269.09 and out of that much money I'm gonna give it probably 260 to debt but we'll see I like to see once my check comes in and then how much money I have left over and all that 
um anyways i hope you like this short video comment down below if you have any questions um don't forget to subscribe if you want to follow me and this journey as i become debt free and i'll see you next time bye